Hey guys, Colby here. Welcome back to another Watcher of Realms video. We have these very unique packs being offered right now for the Black Friday weekend. And I wanted to go over them a little bit uh, with you guys just to see whether it's worth it for you. First things first, if you are a spender, these are only available if you're a spender, okay? You need the W gold for them. You cannot buy them with gems or anything because they give you back gems and then they give you a chance to get a legendary hero. It can be a lord or it can be a non-lord, Absent, Calypso, Hex, Nyx, Razak, or Shilas. For the Piercer bundle and for the Northerner one, it can be King Hearts, Brokir, Nocturne, Sadie, Shamir, or Valkyra. Very strong heroes in, in both of these. Uh, I just want to say, like, I think Hex and Silas are very, very unique and, and strong on their own, while Absent and Calypso and Nyx are a little bit underwhelming. Nyx and Razak are almost like the same, like big AoE heroes can be used for gear rate three, while Hex and Silas are just MVPs for uh, the guild boss, and Silas is MVP everywhere. Okay, Araka, okay, on her own, just fantastic if you're looking for one. For me, like I have all of these except for Hex and Calypso, so this is like the best one for me to buy. And then for uh, this one, I don't have King Hearts and Valkyra. Okay, so this one is the least interesting for me. So. Is this worth it for you guys? First things first, if we have a look on the website, we have the, the value calculator where I input it. I input the number of physic power, psychic power you get out of that because it's five psychic power, you get an immediate level 60, and then you get 2000 diamonds um, already. And then you get the XP that a level 60 requires. So you have to have that in mind as well. And to calculate that, um, I would just go in here and see, right, how much XP is needed to get a level one to level 60. Do I even, can I even get that? So let's say Shamir needs 270,000 to get to level 50 and then a level 50. And then from level 50 to level 60, you need 355K. So uh, what is that? It's if we add those two together, 355 plus 270. I mean, let me get a calculator very quick. 270 plus 355, 625,000 XP. So if I transfer that over to the website, so 625,000 XP, that is worth, how much is that worth really? It's like $3 worth. It's not much actually, if you think about it. So um, the value right now without the legendary is at about $35 and the cost is $50. So if you value one legendary, for about i would say 30 dollars which was the actual price that the offer did in the past so it would have been 65 dollars for the value of this pack right now you you're gonna see like a 1.5 rating for this one a really really good pack has an over 2.0 rating for me at least so um having that average kind of rating it really depends on you guys on how much you feel like gambling in terms of the one out of five one out of six to get the one that you're looking for. But with that said, I am looking for Hex and this is like the best way to get him at the moment. There's no 10X for Hex. I don't think they'll do one anytime soon, maybe for Christmas actually, now that I think of it, but um, that's it. I don't even want Araka, her A1 is not that special. Uh, I don't want Absent, Calypso, Nyx, Razak. Uh, Silas would be nice for the A1. So it's Hex or Silas with this one, but it's totally random, it's, there's a purchase limit of one, so good luck to me, guys. And uh, let's see if this was worth the gamble. Yes, yes, I got a Silas. That was very quick. I got a Silas A1 now. So that was actually worth the gamble for me. So the A1 Silas, guys, if you didn't know, we have a look at him. If you awaken him to A1, increases attack speed by 100 when Shadow Cloak is in effect. So this is very, very nice. Shadow Cloak is his ultimate ability, I believe. So when you get a boosted, you know, attack there just makes him do way more damage when he has his ultimate available. And then he becomes even stronger and stronger. Um, I think. Is it just the A5 that makes him really, really strong? The mark Eye of the Curse will increase physical damage to the target by 15%. That's the A5. That's insane though to get an A5. But still the A the A1 is really, really nice. Very strong. So um, overall, that was worth it, I think. And yeah, how did it go for you guys? Check out the website if you want to put the other values for the packs um, for your own, you know, 
if, if you want to just investigate on whether it's, it's valuable or not for the Black Friday offers, there's going to be more offers every, you know, six hours or something they said. So this ends in four hours. This ends in 12 minutes. So who knows on how good the, these are going to be by the end of the day. Uh, that's it for today, uh, at least for the one, uh, one very, very special bundle that I just purchased. Thank you all for watching. Subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. See ya.